Hi, I'm Mrs. E from Mrs. E Teaches Math. I like to use songs, chants, and cheers to help my students um, remember different properties and theorems in math. Today, I want to share with you how I help my geometry students remember the properties of congruence. Um, there are three main properties of congruence that I teach my students. Reflexive, symmetric, and transitive. Um, I use hand signs um, to help my students remember these. So reflexive, um, it's like your reflex, but also um, you equal yourself. So reflexive statements usually say something like XY equals XY. So it's the same thing. You are your, equal yourself. Symmetric um, usually would be a statement like XY equals YX. Something switches position. So I start with my hands like this and then move my hands apart. So from students view, and they see that the thumb was first and it's no longer in the first position on the second hand. It switched to the last position. So, so far in our little chant, we have reflexive, symmetric, and then transitive. Transitive statements are usually more easier for students to recognize, but they need to remember that there are three parts and there are three syllables to transitive. So I have them enunciate each syllable. So the hand cheer or the hand sign would go like this. Reflexive, symmetric, transitive. Reflexive, symmetric, transitive. And I would have my students stand up because they need to get their wiggles out. And um, we would do this together as a class and chant it um, two or three times throughout the lesson. Um, and then the next day as the warm up, I would have them do it again. Thanks.